I want to be a better Christian next year. I want to believe God. And I don't know if anybody's with me, but there have been days where I felt like I've had faith that if God asked me something, I could do it. And then I've had days where if he asked me, I'd be looking for my faith. Like it was here yesterday. I know I had it yesterday, but where did it go today? Hello. Some days it seems like I could just kill the devil, amen, one-handed, amen. And other days I'm looking, what's going on here, amen. So that's not consistency. That's not where God wants me to be. He wants me to believe his word no matter what I feel, no matter what it looks like, amen. I read the man's testimony about healing. And he began to share how that his body was screaming to him that he was not healed. But the word of God declared to him that by the stripes of Jesus, he was healed. And if he could believe that he received it, he could get it. And so he chose to believe what the word of God said above what his body was telling him. And the man rose up well. Amen. I remember the story. I'm preaching tonight, amen, to me. But I remember the story of a man who belonged to a different denomination, not a full gospel denomination. And he got sick and he started studying healing out of the Bible. And he was asked to go to this place to preach. And so he preached on healing. His whole sermon was on healing. And when he got done, he said, I take Jesus as my healer today. And so after the service, some of the men said, we would like you to go to lunch with us. The only thing, it's up the mountainside. you got to walk up the mountainside to the restaurant. Amen. And this man had a bad heart previously. But he was claiming healing. Amen. And he knew that if he said no, then he wasn't really believing God. And he said it was the hardest thing he ever did, but he climbed that mountain. He began to walk. He said there were times where his heart felt like it was going to beat out of his chest, but he said, I claim Jesus as my healer. Amen. And by the time he got to the restaurant, he was completely healed by the power of God because he took Jesus over his condition. Amen. It's difficult to do this. Lots of people don't want to live this way. Amen. Lots of people want to live by money. Even on television, many different places, amen, people live by how much money they have, not by faith. Very few people I know will go out, amen, just at the beck and call of God. God intended, amen, for us to follow him. And it's not based on how much money we got, but it's based on what we believe. And so because we believe God, and this is where I'm going tonight, amen, we need to read the Bible because faith comes by hearing and hearing by the word of God. 